the Netherlands the best place to be at? The place of tulips. We most importantly the place of all scandals. After the recent drama surrounding the Voice of Holland, I thought it was only fair to discuss with you guys as well what is going on right now with Ajax. Let me start off by saying it has nothing to do with Ajax being the club. It just had to do with one person within the club and also the kind of the culture, but I don't think it's very fair to just blame it on the club. Director of football Mark Overmars has left the club after admitting he sent inappropriate messages to women working at the club. Sunday, January 6, 2022. I have released a statement regarding their director of football affairs, and we will get deeper into that in just a second. Mark Overmars, who worked at Ajax as a director of football affairs since 2012, currently 48 years old, born in the Netherlands and really had what people can call an inspiring career, starting off as a soccer player and he became eventually one of the most important people to work at Ajax. His contract with Ajax even got extended till 2026 also the reason why I really had to release a statement regarding the situation. He was not just a regular employee, he was on top of this whole game. Director of Football Affairs Mark Overmars will leave Ajax with immediate effect. He made this decision after discussion in the recent days with the supervisory board and CEO Edwin van der Sar and communicated his intentions to them. A series of inappropriate messages sent to several female colleagues over an extended period of time underlies his decision to leave the club. This December, NRC was investigating these allegations. They managed to create a safe place where females could share their story to the whole world. In total, 11 women came forward to share their story. Het meest stuitend vond ik eigenlijk, wat ik eruit las, was dat ze Overmars echt moesten overtuigen dat wat hij gedaan had, dat dat echt niet kon. He managed to take it even further. And how did he do that? Well, he sent the pics. I am ashamed. Last week I was confronted with the reports about my behavior and how this has come across to others. Unfortunately, I didn't realize that I was crossing the line with this, but that was made clear to me in the recent days. I suddenly felt enormous pressure. I apologize. Certainly for someone in my position, this behavior is unacceptable. I now see that too, but it's too late. I see no other option but to leave Ajax. This also has a major impact on my private situation and that is why I ask everyone to leave me and my family alone. The Me Too movement really is active within the Netherlands. I think we all have been aware of the consequences it can bring by doing things that are unwanted, especially on a large platform. This is the reason why also sponsors need to take a better look at what they are sponsoring at that moment. And that's what Ziggo is doing right now. Ziggo released a statement saying that they will keep a close eye on all the developments that are going on. I mean, Amro, one of the main sponsors of the female Ajax team released a statement saying that they will still be supporting Ajax. They really believe that they have taken the right actions right now. Now back to Mark, because I really think that it's very disgusting what he has done, especially when you hear that he is even sending these pictures or messages literally at work. If you have a position like he has, I think it's very hard to get around the fact that everyone wants to talk to you right now, everyone wants to share this story, because we can take so much out of this whole movement, out of all these situations that are happening. Maybe it's bad to assume this, but I really do believe that this is just beginning of something that is really turning into the real Titanic right now. And then can the Ajax go to the high level, but that's right then. It's a crisis for Ajax and a crisis for them. That's bad for Ajax. Yeah, the glory times are now over, probably. It's a bit clear now. Yeah, it's a bit clear. On Twitter I found this poem that I really want to share with you guys. See what this does to your victims. Look at what this does to your wife. See what this does to your kids. See what this does to your job. See what this does to your club. I can't be immediately but I definitely believe that over the next few years, it will definitely cause a change. As I am editing this video, EA decided to remove Mark Overmars as an icon from FIFA 2022. I really appreciate the fact that Bose made that video exposing the voice because it triggered this bigger movement that didn't reach the Netherlands yet. I have so much respect for all the victims, but also for the people that really encourage all those victims to share their stories with a larger audience. That's my video for today for you guys. If you like these kind of videos where I dive a little bit deeper into things, and especially with all the scandals going on, I'm pretty sure this is not going to be my last video surrounding a scandal. Subscribe if you want to receive weekly a video surrounding those topics. And don't forget to leave a like or a comment. Everything would help my channel out more than you would even realize. Thank you so much and have a great, wonderful day wherever you are. Bye-bye. <laughs>